Uh, hello, everybody. Welcome back, uh, brothers, sisters, Mr. and Mrs., uh, he, she, them, whatever. Hello, welcome, world. Um, I'm not sure if it's hooked up to this or it's hooked up to my thing. Um, so, <laughs> um, today I wanted to talk about something that I find very interesting each time I read the Book of Mormon that helps to solidify the fact that the Book of Mormon is or was translated by Joseph Smith and wasn't just him coming up with stories. Um, and it starts off in the Book of Mosiah with uh, Mosiah being the king. Uh, it's at the end of Mosiah, so I believe it is 29. Maybe it's, maybe it's 28, yeah, 29. So he's about to die. King Mosiah is about to die. Um, so he asks the people what they want to do or who they want to be the king, you know, because um, that's what they have in mind. So he just asks, you know, being a rightful king, he's like, who do you guys, well, who would you like to be our king? And the people come out, as you can read, um, it states that they want Aaron, his son, and that causes a problem because Aaron was one of the sons of Mosiah that went with, uh, that went out to teach um, the, the Lamanites. And so he's like, uh, that's a problem. He's not here. Um, so who, who else would you like? And uh, uh, excuse me, I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, and so, like, none of his sons are, are there. Like, they're all off teaching. And so he proposes, like, we shouldn't have kings. And he kind of explains why. Um, he kind of states that uh, he goes, writes a letter, you know, writes it out to people, whatever, to get it out there because he can't just speak because there's just so many of them. So he's writing things down, sending them out, and having them shipped to people, uh, how whatever democracy, uh, um, uh, whatever you want to call it, hierarchy they have built at the time to distribute news from the king. Um, and he, he states that, uh, that the, 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 the crown, the kingdom was denied, declined, they declined the offer because they're, they're gone, they can't be king. Um, and he goes on to state like the reason why he thinks that we should get away of kings and it's kind of very odd because right before this couple i think it's maybe a chapter or two before this he legit read and translated um the the the, the plates the golden plates that were given to him uh, from the time that um, uh, crap the uh, I can't think of their names right now uh, came over um, when 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 Alma I guess led the people back um, from um, the uh, Lamanites um, from the um, area of Nephi. Um, and they, they happened to stumble upon, you know, the, the, these people that were sent to go look for Zarahemla um, got lost. And they found these golden plates that were a record, but they couldn't read it because it was written in uh, uh, Adamic language, the perfect language, because it was written before the langu languages were changed by the Tower of Babel. Um, so that's an interesting topic. Um, whatever language, uh, I'm not sure if it's Adamic, but I, I believe it's Adamic language. It was written, so they can't read it. They don't know what, what, what's being read, um, um, being said in, on these plates. So, of course, they bring him back, and um, King Mosiah, being a righteous man um, and being a prophet, um, he's able to translate these things. And so he gets done reading these, and he reads that it's, it's just not good. You know, the 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 records of uh, the brother of Jared and Jared's people weren't good. The Book of Ether practically uh, wasn't good. Did it didn't have a good ending, and it and it followed this. It, 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 everything he states right here. Um, I fear there would rise contention among you, and who knoweth but what my son, to whom the king doth belong, to turn to be angry and draw away part of the pe people after him. 
uh, which would cause wars and contentions among you, which would be caused by much, um, causing shedding much blood and preventing the ways of the Lord, yea, and destroy the souls of many people. And then he goes on to state, and if my son turns again, uh, turns again to his pride and vain things, he would recall the things which he said and claim his rightful kingdom to the kingdom, uh, which would cause him and also the people to commit much sin. And so he goes on to state all these things. So, this is all, of course, written by Joseph Smith, translated by Joseph Smith in this order. You know, he's reading the book of the, the golden plates that were given to him by the angel of Moroni. So he's translating this. Um, and so he hasn't yet written the, 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 the book of Ether. Um, so how would he know what to write? Unless, of course, he remembers all this. But each time that he went in to tra or translate, to, to write, um, they stated that he never looked at previously what was written. So, the Book of Ether, if we, of course, go to the scriptures real quick, or go to the Book of Mormon, we can see the Book of um, Mosiah is the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8th book in the Book of Mormon. And Ether is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... 13, 14. So there's what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Five books between Book of Mosiah and the Book of Ether. And Alma is heck long. So <laughs> that probably took him a long time to translate. And so there was a lot of time buffering. But mm, I think it's 4, chapter 4. Uh, da, 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 no, it's not four. No, six. No, seven. Yes, seven. So, chapter seven is where we learn the things that Mosiah taught his people to steer away from because of what happened to them. He goes on to state that, um, or it is, it is six. Um, this is when they uh, asked to. The, the people ask, they're like, hey, we desire a king. And the brother Jared's like, that's not a good idea. Being a mighty prophet, you know, he can foretell these things. He's like, kings aren't good. <laughs> um, that's kind of the reason that Babylon, the Tower of Babel, was going to happen. Was, you know, they, 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 they know these things. They, they went through all this trouble and tribulations and whatnot with kings. So brother Jared's like, that's not a good idea. Jared's is just like, mm, let him, let him have it, let him have it, and uh, so then they decide they're like, hey, we want, um, we want uh, the brother of Jared's firstborn child, uh, Pagag, Pagag, however you want to pronounce that, to be their king. He refused. Okay, so just like King uh, Mos Mosiah, uh, King Mosiah's Aaron. That refused because he wasn't there to accept it. Okay, so then they're like, who else would you like? And then um, they asked for, uh, they, they went down the line asking for like all of his sons and they were all denying him. Uh, and then she so chose all the brothers of Pegag and they would not. They were like, no, uh, we're going to listen to our father. Our father said no, so we're not going to be kings. And so then they finally come up and they ask, uh, they ask to uh, the sons of Jared, and they all start refusing. Besides, uh, Orha, Oriha, however you want to say that, uh, which he becomes the first king, and then shortly after, he, one of his sons, uh, at the age of thirty-two, rebels and starts causing issues and just. If you read the Book of Ether, it describes everything King Mosiah states, that the sons grow up hating their fathers, and then the other son comes up defying the mother, and it just, it's just a mess. It's a mess. And so Mosiah, clear back in the Book of Mosiah, King Mosiah literally states that these things are to pass because literally right before the, before the, the kings, he reads the Book of Ether. He read it all. And Joseph Smith happened to know what was happening in the Book of Ether 
before he read it, or wrote it, wrote it, translated it, or wrote it, and translated it, because it was truly written at that time, because Mosiah read that. Joseph Smith hadn't yet. Joseph Smith had not re read the book of Mosiah, or uh, Ether. He hadn't gone through that. He hasn't translated that yet. So therefore, the only thing that it could be is that the Book of Mormon's true. And that King Mosiah was real, and he read, translated the Book of Ether, and saw what happened to them, and didn't want that to happen to his people. So he diverted them from kings to judges. And later on in the Book of Mormon, we find the Book of Ether. And we see that, and we're just like, hmm, no wonder Mosiah wanted this. But you come to find out that Joseph Smith kind of knew, to, had to have translated it. Like, there's no possible way of him coming up with this stuff and remembering it. And just, that's just, I just, I just can't explain it very well uh, on camera. Um, but... Yeah, that's, that's a fun story, thing that I like to read about in the Book of Mormon. Each time I read it, I think about that all the time. Um, so hopefully you learn something from it. Hopefully it, something new. If you knew that, awesome, great. I appreciate a like on the video. I don't know. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Sure, love ya. Bye.